down the hole and see if we can find more diorite. Some polished diorite. How beautiful. Oh yeah, I can see some already. Woo! Ouchies. Oh, lots of pavement. We need lots of stuff. Lots of stuff. I'm cool, nice. My pick duplicates it as well. Which is good. He has four. Which I don't think I don't think it can. I just died. Oh no. Dun, 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 dun. Dun, 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 dun. And they're gonna come back. Because the server's so laggy. There they okay, are. I don't think this. I, I don't think this can handle it. Yeah, feel my pain. Uh, when I was growing up, I never had any way to record YouTube videos, and I, I yeah. always, I always wanted to do it. And when I like finally was able to, I just couldn't be bothered. <laughs> <laughs> So, I had so much energy and I had so many ideas, but now that I can do it all, it just... I don't know. Yeah. It's like, you want everything, then you get everything, and then you don't know what to do after that. Like, I've got everything I've wanted, I just don't know what to do. <laughs> Pizza! Uh... Pizza. I've got all the rock I need to make more pavement. Da, 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 da. I just said something for the big movie and just left. Okay, and please. All what? I heard when you left there was something about the B movie. <laughs> you went one second no, B uh... movie. <laughs> uh, uh, I said please be here. But, oh, let's see, there's a folder here called old. Called old. Oh, da, dang. Da, da, da. It's not, it's not it. Da, da, da. It's not here. Darn it, I deleted it. No. It was all in Portuguese. I hope there's something in my iMovie, uh, thing. Now I'm serious, the game company choose. <laughs> Someone just said something about game company. Oh, what? Well. What? What's that link he just posted? What? So we just posted a link in the <laughs> in the game. Uh, a link for John. Oh, they're talking about Death Inc. What? <laughs> I regret coming here. <laughs> See, I was around before then. <laughs> what? Yeah, there's another like YouTube channel called Ambient Studios, and, and uh. they're, they're like a game company. Uh. Making a bridge over this water. <laughs> I I regret opening iMovie. Right.
car. Okay. I regret doing that. Oh look. Chroma key test. Oh yeah yeah, I saw that. I like how you actually named it what? the right thing as well. What? Chroma key. Usually everyone just calls it green screen. <laughs> Oh, you mean on the LAN file? No, the video you uploaded uh, to YouTube. Oh! You dumbass. <laughs> ah! Right. The TARDIS uh, yeah. chroma key. You called it chroma key, which I like. Yeah, this is a different one. Yes, yes. That's the... So everyone usually calls them green screens or something. Crap. I, I have uh, camera tracking test. That's, that's fun. God damn it, I wish I had my like really good axe. So many trees chopped down. You can actually see Nidtown from over here with my um with my um oh. range. So I've made a path that pretty much goes straight out of the um uh, town, city, whatever you want to call it, uh up and then into the town, um, so people can find a safe route. And, uh, okay. Hopefully, the people will continue building up the path until we literally connect these two towns together. I hope that happens. That'd be cool. We we'll just have hardly anything here. It looks like something from. <laughs> Hello and welcome back to Dark. Um, today I have something very, very exciting to show you. So, before I move, before I do anything, have you heard of client-side mods? Of course you have. Everyone has. Everyone here knows everything about Minecraft these days. Client-side mods are something only you can see, only you can interact with. Otherwise, everyone else can't see them. Like shaders and um, in inventory sorts, where I can sort my inventory in many different various of ways. Um, only I can do this. Uh, unless you install the mod as well. Um, so, recently I was looking more into, um, client-side mods, and I found out there was a lot more you could do with client-side mods. So the first one is this. It changes the sound effects of blocks. And as well as, like, the character jumps. So, it's awesome. I'm going to turn my sound up. So I absolutely adore this, especially the metal. And if you hear, if you listen carefully, there's actually like a reverb. There's like an echo. Which I absolutely adore as well. Plants make sound effects. Um, and when we get to it, which we're going to get to it now. Um, so... Certain rooms and certain objects will muffle the sound, so using wool would be like using um, the, the those foamy sound things that YouTubers use, like Markiplier and PewDiePie, to uh, stop the neighbors and stuff from hearing them shout. So, wool muffles audio, and, my god, chests make sounds as well. I wonder if chests echo. Oh, that's eerie. I might just build a massive cathedral for this exact reason. So... Uh, we're gonna go outside, and you're about to, like, feel everything. And also, the, the town's changed to quite a lot since, um, last time we recorded. I had a break, mainly just to somewhat escalate the town and to get people here and to stuff. But, uh, yeah, the codes are now available, um, on my Discord. If you want them, just ask and I'll, um, send you them. Or you can just TP to me on Minecraft. I'm nearly always online now. Alright, so let's have a look at this. Here we are outside, um... In my city, and uh, this is actually a dark alleyway uh, that I use as my t TARDIS parking. Um, so yeah, let's show you this. So first, one, first thing you might notice is birds and chalking and stuff and wind. Like these aren't added sound effects; these are all in Minecraft. I'm amazed I'm ha having like a solid um, 20 or 30 FPS. 
That's great. Um, my God, this is beautiful. So in a sec, what the fuck is that? I don't know. I'll have to fix that now, won't I? And water makes sounds. Waterfalls ha actually have a different sound effect now. They actually sound like water effects, uh, waterfalls, and they also um, give off water kind of particles. And look, even bubbles in the water you might see there. Coming from the sand and dirt and gravel from below, which is fucking amazing. This should be in Minecraft normally. Yes, yeah, so this is the town. Quite a lot's changed, actually. Uh, if you look on the mini map here, uh, we have practically overtaken both towns uh, in size. Um, this here is the first a new apartment block building we've been making. It took some time, but we got it. Probably done it in two hours, maybe. So that's the first building that we're going to explore. First thing up, though I want to show is spawn. Oh, it's weird. It's eerie. At spawn we have a waterfall here. Fucking brilliant. Also, another way to get to Ambient Town is by doing slash warp ambient city v3 and then just you'll be here. Uh, this is the tower. Uh, there's actually a waterfall thing here. This is a building area, so be careful. So you see this guy's waterfall is actually louder. Mainly because the water is um, bigger. I'm just going to leave that there for now, but I don't know what he's planning on making. Uh. Right, so let's go up the tower. This might echo a lot, uh, due to how weird this building is. Also, if you equip items, uh, they have different sound effects. I like the sword sound effects, uh, mostly. But ingenious. Minecraft is just upgrading by the second. It's fucking brilliant. So let's climb this tower and show you the grand view while also showing you the night sky uh, sound effects. When it gets dark, different sound effects echo from different days. So at, at daytime, you'll have the birds twer uh, twerking, t tweeting, and at nighttime, you'll have the crickets and whatnot. So this is the town. I should probably turn my render distance up. Um, I shouldn't have done that. Uh, so this is the town. Um, so far, we've ha we've got um, 20 residents. So it's it's blooming. So let's climb this tower. And I will show you, um, this is kind of like an observation deck, <coughs> just mainly for the whole views. Uh, nobody can live up here, it's mainly just for public use. Um, downstairs though, all those rooms that we went past, those are apartments which people can live in. So let's show you the beautiful sound effects coming from the outside. How fucking amazing is this mod? It's just the best thing ever. Uh, if you want these mods, I will put them into a Google Drive folder. All of my mods that I currently have equipped, my shaders, um, my infantry salt mods, everything. And I'll put them in the link in the description for now on. Um, my god, so beautiful. Is that a death? No, it's not. Uh, if the mods aren't there for you guys, then uh, it's either you're watching this in the future and I've deleted my Google Drive, or uh, you, your computer's just having problems. So yeah. I heard a dragonfly there, that was weird. Let's dive off this tower into the water and hopefully survive. Unless someone's extended the, the lake. Jump there? No, let's take the hard way. Da, 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 da. Sploosh. Yes, yeah, so this mod, um, I'd say the sound effects mod and echo and reverb and stuff, you wouldn't need a good PC for, but for shaders you probably will. Um, the water effects one, you probably won't need a good PC either. It just adds sound whilst some particles, which I think you can turn off.
So yeah, this is the town so far. Uh, everyone's welcome to join. Um, I would actually c uh, continue recording right now, but the thing is, I need to get some stuff done before I um, continue the series. So, um, expect the tech series, if that hasn't started already, to start coming up. Uh, you don't have to watch it if you don't want to watch it. It's just a mainly, it's like a gap filler. To kind of give, show you guys I'm still giving you stuff. While doing um, education. Actually, let's run to the TARDIS and see if the uh, takeoff sounds echo as well. That would be quite interesting. Let's find out. This would be quite good for people who have really... Oh, the door echoes and works. This would be good for people who have... Like, really large TARDISes that echo. Let's try this. So, let's go to... Waypoints. Uh, let's go somewhere unique. Um, like... The... Dalek Dino, which is probably wrecked. doesn't seem to echo, probably because it's a modded sound and the game isn't uh, referring to it Oh no, it's Dalek Diner, go on Dalek Diner? Oh, it's still here Oh, I'm the only person here I did actually build some buildings here for them once, uh, a while back But I removed them in fear of being deranked I got deranked anyway uh, I built them over here and I think I tried to cover up my tracks by um, making this land look as natural as possible. But if you literally dig in a few blocks, I'm pretty sure it's all hollow, yeah. <laughs> you see, the reason this room isn't echoing is because it's surrounded by dirt. So dirt's a good, um, a good way of actually stopping blocks from echoing. So I feel like if you put these behind a wall, that might do good. I think if you walk through grass as well. Yeah, it has a different sound. Oh! <gasps> I did not know it did this. Look, it adds like little, uh, little light bugs. L what do you call them? Oh, fuck. Um, I'm just gonna call them light bu bugs. Um, I did not know it did that. That's really smart. Who was the smart ass that thought it'd be hilarious to leave this tree uncut? Why do people do this? It triggers me so much. <laughs> yeah, so I built them some, like a big twin tower right there, and I also built them like a line of houses here. Uh, and of course, I tried to cover up my tracks because I knew. Um, shortly after I did it, I thought that oh, this might actually be a bad idea. Oh, this was a this was Twister Boy's uh, Tardis parking um, spot. You land as Tardis in here for the shits and giggles. Oh, it looks like water also muffles sound. So you can hear the the the, 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 the um crickets, and then when you go under, you can't hear the crickets. Where exactly are we? We're very far away from um the city. Not chance we're gonna walk there. Yeah, so update 48 is coming out. Very exciting. Can't wait till it comes out. I think everyone else can't wait. I actually can't wait. Um, originally, I had um, some bad ideas about this whole mod, considering what happened to the city. I'm over the city now. Uh, the few updates, uh, the few videos that are about to come out may seem like I'm very pissed off. I was pissed off at the time, but I'm over it now. That Those videos were recorded quite some time ago. Um, so, yeah, I, I'm going to stick around for this mod. I'll just continue doing the survival. Um, I'm not sure if people will watch it or not, but that's fine. Hello, Creeper. That Creeper looks like he's having a hell of a good time. Hmm. I also might do a video on that one uh, server on Minecraft that's been abandoned um, for nine years. It's been, it's a server that's been running for nine years. Maybe longer, um, yes, and um, pretty much what's happened is it's just a state of decay, everything's collapsing, it's, it's absolutely crazy. So yeah, expect a few videos on that as well. Like, it's it's not really much about the views, it's about my own need for this one, I'm really interested in this kind of server. I kind of like the whole idea of, um, oh my god, look at the TARDIS reflecting in the window there. I can't just do men, but 
Look at that. That's crazy looking. Look, it even flips the sign. Oh my god. That is just insane. Okay, I'm gonna make a thumbnail. It's actually a really good um, view. That's good. This is how you make thumbnails, kids. Tardis in the thumbnail, boom, there you go. Thumbnail. Let's <laughs> take like a screenshot as well, just for the sake of comedic value. So, let's get back inside and hop back to the town. And there's just something on here that I say that I want to check out. Oh, also, yeah, I um, probably should have given a tour of my TARDIS. Uh, this is the console room. Someone actually commented a few days ago, why is your TARDIS so small? Uh, I make it so small because um, the console rooms that people make, those, those like 4x4 four four large consoles, it's just disgusting. In, in reality, this is the size it would be. Look, it's square, so what? It's Minecraft, you can't exactly fix it. And I would rather make it feel accurate than attempt to make it accurate. So this is this is the one I like, and I've spent time at this. Uh, the reason it's blue and white is because of my um, dragon's design. You may see my dragon profile picture on YouTube and some other things on Discord. Um, it's my mascot for my channel. Uh, and also I just really like the color blue. And it's going to suit with the, the upcoming uh, TARDIS exterior that's coming. And it's also going to have its own TARDIS door. Uh, this whole TARDIS will be available to be used. Um, even the, the interior, the exterior, once the exterior is done. Uh, in the next update, hopefully, if Ed finishes everything. Um, if you want to know how, how I've done this, it you can't really do it anymore. But at one point, you could actually pay uh, DMU um, to make to, for them to make you a TARDIS exterior. And then they would copy your interior for more money, of course, and then put it in the mod. But unfortunately, this isn't this is like unavailable, and I managed to just just, just do it at the very end. Uh, the bug can't cancel the whole thing now. You can't really do it anymore. Just big bummer. It's always nice to see more Tardis is in the game. Uh, and then through here, uh, this is where my enchantment room is going to be. I think I actually did a video on this already. And uh, this is my. Um, Potato and carrot farm. Uh, potato and carrots are like the best fucking Minecraft food ever. Because carrots you can just eat and they're awesome. Potatoes you cook and it's practically um, apples. Um, like raw apples because you can't cook apples of course, you know, Minecraft. Also, I like this whole like roof design here. I think if I was to turn my brightness all the way down, uh, it would make no difference. Uh, brilliant. Oh, what have I done? God, I can't get enough of these sounds. It seems like the, these three blocks all sound metallic. Probably because they're a TARDIS block. Um, what's this lava sound like? Same sound. Okay. Uh, this is my automated um, cooking system that I've set up here. I uh, actually need to put my potatoes in this one. Uh, Cool, should just be fine, right? Awesome. Yes, and this is all the resources I'm using to rebuild the town. Um, I'm actually almost through all of them. Uh, I think I've used two chests worth already, which is kind of um, kind of scary. If I put my poisonous potatoes in here, no, I have. I actually have a lot of poisonous potatoes. That sucks. I love poisonous potatoes. The grit. The fact that you can get a whole potato that just, it's designed to kill you. It's just brilliant. It's a brilliant idea. Whoever made it, I want to I wanna have um, time with in the bedroom. So yes, uh, expect, expect more videos uh, coming up soon. And uh, till then, goodbye. I need an outro, fuck's sake. Like I need like a new outro. I can't just say goodbye all the time. I need like some spinny graphics at the end. Um, Expect that sometime. Goodbye.